My name is Bert, and this is the Still Life Podcast. Welcome back to another episode of the Still Life Podcast. As always, I'm your host, Bert. So today, today is one of those days. I have plenty of things to do. I really just don't feel like doing any of them. You know, I just, I don't know. I slept decently. Uh, I just don't think I slept long enough. Tired. Allergies are still fighting with me. And I just can't seem to find that motivation today to be productive. You know, um, I've got laundry done. I need to put it away and I really just don't feel like it. You know, I got a little bit of cleaning to do around the house, not a ton of stuff, but again, I just really don't feel like it. I want to lay around and be lazy and you know, it's not a particularly great thing, but you know, I just, man, I'm not feeling it today. You know, I need to get out and run a couple errands to get some groceries and stuff like that. And I just... You know, like, I just don't feel like getting out of the house. I don't feel like doing anything, you know, and I don't know if in some ways, maybe it's a little bit of depression. I just, I'm really not sure. I I don't know what to make of it. I don't know how to get past it, but I just am like, eh, like whatever. So, you know, when we get the feeling like that, how do we break that cycle and find the motivation to do things? Or do we ever really have to find the motivation? Is it more of a you know, just do something begrudgingly or, you know, reluctantly, and maybe you'll just build some momentum and just keep moving. And so, you know, once I get done with this episode here, uh, I'm going to tackle the laundry and then I'm going to run to the grocery store and, you know, we'll see what happens. I'm not excited by any means to do any of this. Um, you know, now I did get out this morning, did get a little bit of fishing in and unintentionally stayed out for about two hours. I was only going to go out for about an hour at most and, uh, was hitting crappie and bluegill pretty good. So I stayed out for a little while and, you know, got a little bit of sun, uh, more than I was anticipating and my head is a little bit sunburned. And so, you know, that's wearing on me too and and it's just a combination of things but it's like I'm just you know kind of feeling blah so uh you know I gotta make myself do some stuff now I did lay around for a little bit and just kind of surf you know social media on my phone didn't really do anything productive at all so now it's like "Eh, I gotta get some stuff done I need to feel like I've accomplished some things today so you know now it's time to buckle down do a couple things, and then I can relax this evening and enjoy the evening. The other really weird thing, too, is that when I get in these moods, I also, like, don't eat. Like, I'm just not hungry, or, like, I'll forget to eat. Like, I, you know, I looked at the clock, and here it is, you know, quarter to four in the afternoon. I never ate lunch today, and I'm not really hungry. Don't feel hungry at all. feel fine. So, you know, whatever, but I will definitely be eating dinner Uh, You know, so it's like inadvertent fasting, essentially. But, you know, it's like I get in that mood. I forget to eat. I'm not hungry. I don't feel like eating. And, you know, it's again like how do I kind of get out of this like micro funk, you know, and it's I think a matter of just making myself do something productive uh, as much as I really don't want to Um, just for my own self. You know, I need to get the laundry put away so it's not, you know, laying in the basket and laying on the bed, you know, or laying in the chair or whatever. I just, I need to get that little bit of organization and cleaning done because I think it will make me feel better, Um, you know. But again, don't feel like it. So it's kind of that back and forth battle. And, you know, I was dreading doing this episode today and I put it off for like an hour and a half. Again, I just don't feel like doing anything. You know, so so maybe there is kind of a little bit of depression going on today. I really don't know. Like, I don't feel terrible. Like, I'm not sad or anything like that. I just, I'm lacking energy and drive today for whatever reason. And it's kind of driving me nuts, but at the same time, I don't care. So, you know, it's this weird kind of like back and forth battle going on between like, eh, we should do something. Eh, we shouldn't. Nobody cares. It doesn't matter. Let's just be lazy. But I got stuff I need to get done. So we're going to do it now. 
you know, putting this out there and talking about it. And now I'm like, no, you know what? I got to hold myself accountable and I got to get this stuff done. So now when I get done with the podcast, yeah, I'm going to tackle the laundry. I'm going to get it done, get it squared away and be done with it. Then there's one less thing I have to worry about for another week. Don't have to wash any clothes for a week. I'll be good. And it's done and I can relax. I don't have to look at it anymore. It'll all be put away. So, you know, that'll be good. Maybe it'll motivate me to, you know, finish doing a little bit of organizing that I need to do and a little bit of other cleaning. You know, that's the hope anyway. And it looks like I can hear a little bit of thunder. It's supposed to be some pretty nasty storms moving in uh, later on this afternoon. So, you know, maybe I'll run to the store first before I do laundry uh, just so I don't have to get out in the storms. But it is what it is. No big deal either way. We'll see. We'll roll with it. Um, but anyway, yeah, I, I don't have much of a topic other than that. It's just, you know, I, I, I'm making myself do these things that I don't want to do because I don't feel like doing them. And so, you know, when I get in these spots, this is what happens. I don't know if you guys experience the same thing at all, but, you know, I would encourage you to comment, share, you know, if this happens to you and, and how you push through it, how you find a way through it. Um, you know, I'd be curious to know what your guys' solutions are. So, um, you know, with that, I'd like to thank you guys for joining me today on the Still Life Podcast. As always, for questions, comments, topic ideas, suggestions, or to become a sponsor of the Still Life Podcast, you can reach us, the Still Life Podcast at gmail.com. That's the Still Life Podcast at gmail.com. Thanks again for joining me today on the Still Life Podcast. Hope you all have a great weekend, and we'll talk again soon.